Hey guys, it's Stephanie and today I'm going to show you how to use Plenty. It's a site generator and it's built on Svelte and uses Go. And uh, it's a really, really cool site generator. It's in the infancy stages. If you want to learn more about it, you can go to plenty.co. Basically, it's going to give you the ability of uh, easy development, and if you're not so much a developer, you'll be able to edit right on the page. So let's get into it. All right, so what I've done is I've gone into GitHub's um, Plenty web page here. This is where you can read the instructions on how to download. Um, I've just actually I just googled Plenty Co. So I can just show you here Plenty Co. And it should be the first hit you get. If it's not, you can just type in this URL right here github.com dash Plenty Co. Alright, let's click into this repository and we're going to go down and let's go through the requirements now. So as of version 0.2.0, you no longer need Node.js, Go, or any dependency other than Plenty itself. All right, so since I'm working with a Mac, I'm going to go to the, I think I'm going to choose the Homebrew installation settings. So I can do that. I'm going to open my terminal. Let's just go and click Terminal. If you don't have Terminal on your dock, you can just search it right on the top here. So let's go back. I'm going to minimize this. I'm going to just copy this, these instructions right here. Let's see where I'm at. Okay. I'm going to paste those instructions. Give it a little bit of time. It's updating my homebrew at the moment. All right, cool. Looks like it updated homebrew. Just going back to see what's been updated here. Wow, that's a lot. All right, cool. So we have that. Now, now we need to install Plenty. I'm just going to copy and paste that command. I'm going to paste it right here. Okay. So that looks okay. So I think plenty has just been installed. All I had to do is update homebrew and um, input the brew install plenty. And it looks like it's installed. Let's see if it works. Okay, I'm going to go to the Get Started section. It says Create a New Site. I'm going to type in Plenty New Site My New Site. Okay, it says it created Plenty Site Scaffolding in my new, my new site folder. Now I'm going to cd, so I'm going to change directory into my new site. Okay, I'm in the folder, and now I'm going to start the development server plenty serve. And it's asking me if I want to accept the incoming network connections. Click allow. And now I can visit my site at this local host. Okay, let's just type that in. Localhost 3000. And there you have it. Those simple steps and you get a quick website. Click through, post to. So you quickly get this blog um, web page. You can just update plenty and use this default page that he's created or you can create it uh, with that with a flag to have a clean site um, but that's it that's that's how quick and easy it is to install plenty uh, for more of these tutorials please subscribe to Janku we'll be posting more 
especially as the development of this site generator um, goes on, we'll be showing you different updates. Thank you. Uh, let us know if you have any questions, comment below, and I look forward to showing you more of these tutorials.